Ladies and gentlemen, Michael B's and Michael C's, welcome back. We're going to be playing some more Death Stranding, the weirdest Hideo Kojima game that I've ever seen, and that says a lot. Mm, we'll see. Wow, you think it might not be weirder than like the Metal Gear Saga, like, Legacy? Well, I don't know, MGS2 is pretty weird towards the end. Alright, well, there's beached whales right here, and creepy shit in the sky, so let's get, let's just... Can I continue? Oh yeah, go ahead. Okay. Oh yeah, go ahead. You can hit continue, my man. I wonder why it's loading so slowly. A certified pre-owned hot dog. <laughs> How many miles are on that certified pre-owned hot dog? The world may never know. But they might also. <clears throat> when near a BT, use R1 to hold your... Oh, dang it. I know all these things. I'm an expert at this game. I know all these tips and tricks. Check the dog facts. Hmm. Are you awake? Yeah. Was all that laughing we did? Yeah, I think that helped. All right. I laughed him awake. You know what they say, laughter is the best medicine. Unless you're genuinely sick, in which case, Jesus, just take some medicine. Take some real medicine. Sam. This is Die Hardman. There's a private room set aside for your use. Bridges perk. <clears throat> Take a moment to clean up, wash all that chirelium off, then come to the president's office. Sliver Underlord, have a good night, buddy. I appreciate you. <clears throat> Examine figures? Examine them, Michael. That's interesting. Yeah, examine it again. Oh, drink that monster energy. Stamina back. So the last, <clears throat> the last part, we ended up <clears throat> throwing his mom into the incinerator, and then uh, trekking back, trying to avoid all the BTs. Take a shower, man. Take that hot Norman Reedus shower. I'm glad the product placement is not super obvious. Same, same. I'm glad it's very obscure, and this is this is inappropriate. <laughs> Watch out, YouTube police gonna get you. Oh God. Sam. Sam, can you hear me? Why you little low? Is it? I haven't sake. changed it. Is it anything private anymore? Oh, uh, no. Except for taking a shower and going to the toilet, that is. That's all I have. I take it you were getting yourself cleaned up. Good. Come to the president's office as soon as you're done. Raise it whenever you get for you. The president's office? She's waiting for you? What? She's dead. Did you ready to get a new president? I mean, it's going to be like an hour before you get the option made. Okay, see if you can do it now. Huh? See if you can change the volume now. You did well, Sam. <clears throat> no, I guess nope. not. Wow. Thank you. Bridget may no longer be with us, but her legacy has a chance to live on. Sam, listen to me. America. Reconstructionism. Her dream isn't dead. I don't want to hear it. This is the face of our new hope. Our new America. How's the volume, guys? Is it okay? 
Lola. Hey, look, we figured out who that is. Homily. The volume seems fine. Maybe Mike's just being a little baby. My mother may be gone, but I'm here. And you, Sam, you're here too. Been ten years since you saw each other, right? And in all that time, she hasn't aged a day. He knows why. <clears throat> My body's still on the beach. I don't get to grow older. All right, well, that's weird. But you do, Sam. That doesn't look anything like Gwyneth Paltrow. So you're serious? Yeah, a little bit. But we can no, not even a little bit. Why, because she's blonde? Yeah, the facial structure. No. You guys don't know what Glenn Powell's someone looks like. Has to succeed, I Sam. do. More importantly, someone has to carry on her legacy and see our country rebuilt. Samantha America Strand, our new president. A new beginning for our people, for our nation. Under Emily's leadership, we'll reestablish the UCA, the United Cities of America. This is how we'll rebuild our country. But we'll need your help to it's do true. it, Sam. I don't look like I'm like one of no, I'm through with this. I said my goodbyes to all of you when I said them to Bridget. We never forgot about you. Man, Daryl plays the same like removed, ran away. distant you character. Cut us off. <clears throat> Emily put together an expedition. The best of bridges won. And went west. in BT territory. I kept them safe while they searched for survivors. Never once missed a BT. Saw them coming a mile away. We convinced community after community to join the UCA. And we left behind our own people to help them. It took us three years, but we managed to make it all the way to Edge Knot City. All the way to the Pacific. Jesus. Yeah, but then everything went to hell. The team was wiped out, and Emily was taken. being kept in a cell or anything like that. I'm allowed to use their facilities and to speak with you whenever I want. I just can't leave the city. It's all to safeguard the continued <coughs> independence of Edgenot City. Well, that's what our keepers are saying, at least. They want the UCA to leave them be. Emily's their insurance policy in case we don't. Who are these assholes again? Homo demons. Militant separatist group. They run Edge Knot City. I've heard of them. A bunch of terrorists who go around towns killing people and leaving craters. Right. Nothing's off limits for them. Not even engineering void outs. Sounds like a bunch of them homo demons. You think the suicide that took out Central Knot was one of theirs? Could be. They're extremists like the demons everywhere, plotting in the shadows. They're decentralized by nature. No one organization to rule them all. Just a common ideology. Bunch of Skeletors. not everyone shares our vision for the future. If we Americans don't come together again, humanity won't survive. I carried my mother's message to people all across the country. But not everyone was willing to accept it. More than a few would rather stay isolated. Keep to themselves. Go it alone. Like you, Sam. Do you have to wear this mask? Because it's real they creepy, man. They think that America can only be rebuilt by force. By men who tell them what to do. Who take away their freedom and put them in shackles. What'd you put on me, huh? You know better than the demons. 
just another kind of cult. They're not shackles, Sam. They're a symbol of our bonds. That's what we need right now. Not to stand apart, but to come together. To form chiral knots and reconnect. Sam, we want you to go west and finish what Emily started. The people she left behind have been hard at work, setting up chiral network terminals. But these terminals are still isolated. We need you to bring them online. And for that, you'll need a Cupid. This contains all the necessary security and operations protocols to integrate a terminal into the chiral web. Take the Cupid West, Sam, and reconnect the people of our great nation. And when you get to Edgenot City, find Emily and bring her home. No wonder this game's so long. He's got to go the, across the whole fucking United States. After that, I'll take over the presidency and carry on Mother's work to save the country. This was Bridget's dying wish. This is how we'll move forward. Please, Sam. We need you. <clears throat> I'm Sam Porter Bridges now. I'm not a strand. Hell, I'm not even part of this outfit. You all saw to that. I'm not getting involved with you or anyone else ever again wait <laughs> see it's like I'm not even here same as it ever was Sam Sam hold on stop listen to me America needs you both of you Covering the world in cable didn't bring an end to war and suffering. Don't act surprised when it all comes apart if you try to do it again. Round and round it goes. Connect, reconnect, it's not that simple. All right, all right, Sam. Just take it easy. I get it. You don't have to commit to anything now. Why not get some rest? Good idea. We all need our sleep. Leave it too long and you're liable to reconnect with the other side. The necessary maintenance has been completed. Various adjustments and fine-tuning for your benefit. You can use it again. For once, it would seem that Dooms and BBs are a good combination. <laughs> or perhaps the two of you have something of an affinity for one another. Game is something else, man. This is that's just the Baby Yoda Mandalorian relationship. I wish I hope someone reskins this game. <laughs> or it's Baby Yoda. Yeah. So that wow. yeah, but Dar but Norman Reedus looks like uh, the Mandalorian. All right, man. Time, my, my turn to play. No, I'm just kidding. It's just funny because there's Has it actually been 30 minutes. No, it's been like it's been third. It's been 14 though. It's been like 15 minutes of only dialogue so far. Why is he out here now? Dream sequence. I don't know. BB just wants his chicken nuggets and chalky milk. Wow. <laughs> don't we Sad. all? Listen, you are Sam Strand. No, I'm not. Not anymore. My name is Sam Porter Bridges. It's a funny word, Strand. A strand is part of rope or bond. While stranding means being washed up on the shore. And being stranded is when you can't go home. I'm stranded now, Sam. Here on the shore of the Pacific. Thousands of miles away. But our bond still holds.
You're free. But we're still connected. Don't tell me we're not. She has a different dress on. Is it the same red dress? No, it was gray for a second. It was weird. Oh. God, it's a real blink and you miss it situation. I'll be waiting for you. I think you might actually get to do something. Sam, this is Die Hartman. You were out like a log. Must have been beat. Private rooms come with all the basic amenities. Shower, toilet, etc. Drop in when you need to rest. Inspect your gear, review info, or whatever else. If you have any questions, feel free to ask our staff. But before you do, why not check things out for yourself? See how Bridges operates these Send days. Send volume up a little bit when you get a chance. I think it's on like 30, you can put up like 40, I would say. Well, I can't. Hitting options and nothing's happening, so. Okay. Well, I might as well activate the terminal then. With that terminal there, you can browse the bridge's database, which has info on a range of subjects. You don't have clearance for everything, but there's still plenty you might find informative. Or not. You did forget your breakfast monster. Let's go ahead and create another monster. I'll go examine that equipment rack. And look, your little baby's got a holster. This case will remove any chiral matter still clinging to your suit. Uh, speaking of suits, blue is for delivery personnel, red for medical, orange for corpse disposal, and black for security. Hmm. Sam, this is Deadman. I calibrated your BB based on physiological data we collected from you earlier. It's still just a best guess, though. After you take it out for a spin, we can check if you're in sync and tweak the BB sensitivity as needed. This game is so weird, dude. Hey there. Believe we've met. I oversee delivery operations as well as maintenance and repairs. Nice to have you on board. I'm Mama, in case I didn't mention it before. Those there are strands. Not just used for packing, by the way, but for identification, too. Take a closer look and you'll see. Oh, wow. See the red there? That's your blood. That's not weird at all.
Okay, I'm done with this. Can I not sit on this bed anymore? Can I... <laughs> Can I play the game? I'd like to play the game now. Do I have to take another shower? <laughs> have I not showered enough today, or... I actually, I, I literally don't know what to do. Well, can you walk or no? Uh, I think this is just examining. Wait, that didn't work. That's because you didn't read it. It said colors will not be changed. Proceed. And you were like, yeah, proceed. Did you confirm with X? Hold it. It's literally showing you the whole button, oh. dude. Okay. Nailed it. Okay, now what? Sit back down, man. Is there Walk. a door? Can you just go to the door? You would think, but I can't. There's Did no... Go to activate terminal and see what else is on there. Like, I'm pretty sure you had to miss something on here. That's a cool menu. There you go. Okay. Okay, I have no orders. Data? I don't care about that. Save it. Oh, here we go. Oh, well, I guess that's one way to get to the audio settings. Let's put up like 30. Okay. Yep, no. I just... Alright, fine, I'll take a shower. Maybe I gotta take a shower to start... Hey. To start the day, I gotta take a shower. Or use the toilet? Sam I don't know. Hartman here. Researcher devoted to uncovering the secrets of the beaches and the Death Stranding, as well as those of Dooms and Repatriates. The shower in your room was designed with chiral decontamination in mind. Chiral matter can adversely affect hormone secretion and nervous function. There's a correlation between exposure and the development of phobias, as well as in extreme cases, violent and suicidal impulses. Chiralian contamination has even been postulated as a trigger for the onset of dooms. I should add that these showers have another function, the collection of blood, hair, fluids, and other natural waste products. They provide a non-invasive means to monitor your exposure to Corellium and your overall health. And I freely admit a chance to study the unique properties of your physiology, you being a repatriate and all. Go back over there. No, no, don't. Oh. Mm, okay. There's exclamation marks next to the things you have to do. There you go, leave. Oh, finally, Jesus Christ. Just kidding. This is the stranding portion of the game. <laughs> well, have you had a chance to think it over? Chock full of Chirelium, but safe for you Dooms guys to wear. That's all you'll need to go forth and reconnect the world. To make us whole again. I'm a porter. I don't care about connecting anything. Or making knots. But I'll do what I have to, to help Amelie out.
Back to the mirror. I won't be glad we can get out of this fucking room, I'll be honest with you. We played for 25 minutes and it's mostly taking place in this room. Listen up, Sam. The terminals Amelie's people built in the towns and cities they pass through on their journey west are called knots. The infrastructure's there, but the Cairo network is offline. Right now, it's only capable of transmitting voice communications. Sometimes wired, sometimes wireless, and a small really amount of data. Can't they have a bracelet that's not so a handcuff so it doesn't look like that? data stored on site, our chirograms won't show up. Emily and the other Bridges members you've seen around the place are grams generated with local data. In case you didn't know. Anyway, all you've got to do is find the knot, connect your cupid, and bring chiral communications online. Once you connect it to the terminal, you'll be able to initiate zero-time massive data transmission with the UCA network. And just like that, you'll reconnect us not only to each other, but to our past. All the lost and fragmented junk data will be compiled and restored. Like bringing a dinosaur back to life from a fossil. Four point six billion years of history on Earth. All the wisdom and knowledge we lost since the Death Stranding will be ours again. And that, my friend, is how we'll beat this thing. Once you establish Cairo communications, generating grams won't be an issue. You'll also be able to use Cairo printers. Won't be long before we're able to send all kinds of things through the wire. Except anything original. Or that's got a soul. Nothing real. Just copies. True. Which is why we'll still need porters like you. Give my baby. Before and after we're made whole, we'll need men in the middle. No rest for the wicked, huh? Yeah, well, idle hands and all that. We'll give you the details at the dispatch terminal. Make sure you check it upstairs. Drop's waiting up there, too. These shoes look like they've done some serious miles. Shall I dispose of them? Wait. Hold on. There's something I want you to look into. My blood seemed to set those things off. Happened more than once. Set them off? How do you mean? I don't know. You took my blood, didn't you? You tell me. All right. I'll see what I can do. Hmm. Did we see that? Yeah, when he was bleeding. They're like shoes. Yeah, when he was bleeding out of his leg under his shoe. Yeah. What was the shoe doing? Well, he had the shoe on. He was just bleeding out of it. Out of the shoe? His like, leg was bleeding. It was dripping down his leg, and, it, and the BTs were attracted to it. Hmm. But didn't he say his boots seemed to set them off? I think he meant his blood. Yeah, his blood seemed to set the boots off, is what it sounded like he was saying. No, that's not what he meant. That wouldn't make any sense. I'm sorry. I agree. Don't worry. I'll take care of him. I promise you. like 30 minutes and it's like we've done like nothing so far yeah even for a kojima game this is pretty ridiculous oh thank god i can move 
Okay. So you want me to start my time now, or? Yeah, no, that's fine. <laughs> Hold on a second. Stay still. Sure, yeah. Okay. I just had to run to the bathroom real quick. Sand, this is Die Hard. Your current objective is to extend the Kairu network from here to Port Knot City. But don't think you can make a beeline straight for it. Signal won't carry that far. To cover the distance, we need to utilize knots. Think of it like uh, tying ropes together to make a longer rope. The first of these knots is a bridge's way station. Go ahead and take a look at the order. Deliver whatever they need and connect the cupid. He doesn't have to keep introducing him every himself every time, I don't think. Oh, you got a mean old Nick Easton. Sam, order summaries may contain information critical to your success. There's just so much information. Make sure to review here. them before getting underway. So you're delivering some smart drugs. Those drugs are fucking smart, dude. Where people are also backpacks. Same. Sam, now we've supplied you with some rope and a ladder for this run. They should help with the steeper inclines, and the ladder will also make a halfway decent bridge if you need to cross a river. Right now, I figure you're thinking about how you want to handle this order. Hold on. Mark says, hey, just got here now because I got trolled by Mother Nature who has sent a skunk to invade my house at the start of the stream. My dogs went nuts and just now I managed to get the thing out alive. Mark, I'm glad you got the skunk out alive, dude. That's awesome. That's also hilarious. Well, just a casual skunk. I have no idea what this... Oh, this is so complex to me. Yeah, I'll take it off. I ain't no little bitch. Frank, it's Alan. I'm a commenter on your Order Twitch stream. Wow. Get out of here. Dream of all right, and this has been part two of our uh, Death Stranding Sam. playthrough, guys. No, just kidding. Triple check your loadout, I take it. This dude looks like if Lowe's was a Halloween costume. <laughs> you know, the store. Right, no, yeah, I get it. It's because it's got a lot, he's got a lot of shit on him. Okay, this isn't too far. It's because he has all the shit on his body, Michael. You understand? I don't know, man. That looks like a distance. You're gonna look like a Gundam suit pretty soon. Have a pleasant journey. Sam, you see that sign someone left over there? You can leave some of your own if you'd like. Mark, I'm so sorry Messages, about the skunk mess, dude. Warnings, words of encouragement, whatever comes to mind. This is like a delivery game with like a social media undertone, like with a with a sub with a. With the social media mini game, we're like leave this guy a friendly message and uh, and give him a like on his Facebook page. Sam, even the best porters have been known to lose their car. I've watched nine streamers play this game from the beginning to end. Good lord, that's crazy. Come across any abandoned shipments. Consider taking them to their intended destination. Side quest. Easier than you might think. See, all our packages are tagged with Bridges IDs for easy tracking. And your Ojo deck is equipped with a scanner, which might detect the enemy. Which is a roundabout way of saying, but that thing on your shoulder can help you locate mislaid shipments. What the fuck is my Ojo deck? Remember, Sam. Every parcel is What's a that? promise made to, to a What's person that? in need. And they're what counting on you to deliver. Oh, you can't pick it up yet. You don't have the plant skill you need to get those hands. 
You can't catch these hands. I named my salmon BB figs. <laughs> Good lord. You're like, I need to I need to up my streamer count to ten. This game is so long too, that's why it's so crazy. Central Crumble, how long would you say the game has been on average? Like, what's the average length that people were playing it for? Or, you know, how long did it take to complete it, rather? The Postman. The remake of the Kevin Costner classic. This is an old, uh, an old favorite of Sam's sunglasses designed with Homo Ludens in mind. Or Homo Ludens again? Not sure. Oh, that was the bad guy, uh, the bad guy group, right? Their form encourages the wearer never to forget their playful side. Their color scheme can be customized in your private room. Oh, look how playful. Drink monster energy. Wow, what a... That's crazy, dude. Every actor in this game looks like themselves, which is really weird because, like, I feel like if you have a game like this, like, the point of a game is to bring a fantasy element to things. And if you're just going to have the actor, like, look exactly like themselves... I almost don't understand it from a gaming perspective. Like, it feels like you might as well just film it, right? The shortest I've seen this play is 50-something hours, and the longest is 90-something hours. So an average of about 70. That's what I was thinking. That's so insane, dude. Don't worry, I'm pro. Yeah, you'll you'll get us there in no time. You couldn't even get out of the friggin' room. What is that? I just <laughs> guess I like it. I don't know what it is. Use the post boxes dot all over the landscape to deliver lost cargo. You just delivered, I think you delivered something and and then you got a like. Oh, this is just like an Amazon lock storage locker where you can put your Amazon packages in it. The funny thing is we will definitely not finish this game before we move, so. Well, yeah. Even if we were playing like a, a 30 hour game, we wouldn't be able to do that. Well, that's 15 parts. Three a week, five weeks. Yeah, I guess that's true. You always try to go up these friggin' these friggin' mountains, man. Because I'm a pro. I'm like you, bro. Trying to get this done, boy. I love Sam's shower scenes. Wow. Yeah, Norman Reedus is definitely a fan favorite. Look at me. That's hilarious. I made it. No problem. Yeah, use the ladder, scrub. Be sure to try Unbelievable. It I'd be interested to see what use as a seasoned pro like you might find for it. <laughs> yeah, the mountain climbing in Skyrim where you're like, I'll go a little bit left, a little bit up, a little bit left, a little bit, I'll do a jump. Oh wow, that thing is How way... How do I get off of it? I... I don't know. I don't know how to do anything. Oh god, that's not gonna work. I think you just made it too tall. Can you make it shorter? Oh. Oh. Eyes open, dumbass. Well. The baby's Not crying. great, Bob. Yeah, hold on. That's L1. Soothe your baby, goddammit! I'm trying to, but it's not working! Rock your controller! Wait, what well that... It's not... Nothing, none of that's working. Yeah, you definitely ignore the prompts. Like, you never read anything that's on the screen. Yeah. Oh, whatever. Which is Shut funny, because I feel like you're always the one telling me to do that. Like, there's always something on the screen that I miss. And you're like, it says not run the screen, do this! But in this game, like, you just haven't read anything. Michael, can you, like, not kill the baby? <laughs> I made it. Okay, L1 down. Square. Does this do anything? I don't know what this- I don't know what the controller itself means. Someone explain, does anyone know? L1 down and square, right? This, this is hold, says, right? You're- you're holding hold it, right? Hold L1. Down. No, now it works. Oh, and now you rock it. Alright. 
Oh, that was something. No, that's not what I... Okay. That's not what I wanted to do. How you feeling about Hideo Kojima now, my dude? <laughs> I'm getting real frustrated, to be honest, because, like, I don't... How do I interact with the ladder without dying? You can't. You're just... This is just your life now. I wish Brazil's post-mail service were as good as the normal readers. Mark, I should totally come visit you in Brazil. Okay, X jumps. Square gets on it. On today's episode of Michael vs. Ladders, the ladders win again. I don't think you can just get around it. I don't think that's a way. I don't think that's how this game I mean, works. That's weird though, because like that's how ladders work. That doesn't really make any sense. Well, not really, because that's how humans work. But I mean, like it's a game. I don't know what button that is. Options. Hold down the options button? That's weird. Are you holding it down? Okay, it's, you're good. Where did it go, though? Did I? <laughs> oh my god, this game, I'm, I'm gonna murder someone. <laughs> this is insane. Like, I didn't want to delete the ladder, I wanted to put it away. Is Wait. it like a one-time use? <laughs> Whatever, man. I'm just gonna climb it. I'll get there. Yeah, I made it. See, no problem. <laughs> I like that, sure. Now, this would be a good place for a ladder, but, uh... Can't you put your ladder there? I don't got a ladder no more, man. It's gone. There's no way that's how it works, right? What? What about right there? And now I have it back? Why was I supposed to know that? But you didn't do anything to find out. How are you so good at every other game? Because like, this this game has a million buttons. Like, it's not... It's not... Like, it's not, uh, intuitive at all. See, this seemed like a good ladder spot. Hi, hi, hi. Are you gonna take a ladder with you? I did because it just goes into your stuff in your stuff. See? Wait, what's the difference in those two? What's the difference between that? Carried on back. Ladder one, ladder one. On tool rack. Why do you have two different ladders? Wait, what's it hold on, go go over them again. Climb no, go over the ladders, please. Ladder, a portable ladder that folds out the length of ten meters can be used to climb steep slopes. What's the other one? Oh, it's the same thing. Yeah. Didn't one say climbing ladder? Why are they? Oh, yeah, two the same ladder. How's your backpack game going, Mike? How, how's the backpack game going? It's going. He was real frustrated like two seconds ago, and now he's climbing these mountains like a champ, my dude. Chris, I haven't seen you for a bit, man. I missed you, buddy. Tell she, Chris, I said hi. Like you do. What is this? What does this mean? I don't know. It probably means you're in a different time. This oh, you disconnect from the chiral network. I don't know what that even means. Okay, that's not something I can do. Uh, yeah, you can use ropes. Use your climbing anchor. Oh, They're yeah. in here. The literal prompts are on the screen to tell you what oh. to do. You're just refusing to read them. I don't know. I just like, it's like not, I don't know. I'm just like not seeing it. I don't know why. There you go. There you go. Ugh. Oh, well. decided to rest. At least you know your limits. That's random. I didn't want to do that, but... Well, you held the button. It wasn't like just a press. You had to hold it. I'm going to massage my shoulders. Oh, wait. Nope, no, you're I didn't want to... <laughs> <laughs> Can I cancel? <laughs> no. Nope. I've never seen a person, like, press the buttons incorrectly this many times. <laughs> it's Look, you got an achievement, man. You got a trophy. <laughs> Guess I got you a trophy, so... Oh, it is AGDQ. I totally understand, Chris. I totally understand. <laughs> this time when you get up, you should probably hit the right button. That'd be cool. Dude, can you do that, you think? Yeah. What? God, thank you so much. I'm just trying oh, to... Just... Nailed it. You don't have space. You gotta back up. 
There you go. So don't press square because that'll release the rope. Jesus, please don't press square. Shoulder rubs don't count against Mike's time. That's true. You could shoulder rub the whole time and it won't it won't uh it won't count against you. Oh, there is a limit. There's 30 meters. I think you're way away from that. Oh, maybe not way away, but you're away. You got it. At least that rope. Don't grab it. I knew you were gonna grab it. Oh my god. You gonna go back up? Okay. No, I wanna, I wanna, um, you don't get to take it. it. You can't. Yeah, I think you do. How? How do you get the anchor out of the ground at the very top? How do you do that? Oh, I have two left. Okay, so this one I can't get back like the ladder. You can okay. get back if you go up it and take the anchor out of the ground. Okay, I guess that makes sense. For once, not gonna climb. I'm gonna go over here. Get out of here, man. I feel like you're learning. Oh, oh look, shit, you're going to Epcot. Demon. That was an Epcot joke because of the ball. It's funny, the one that's up there. Good, good talk. You don't even care for my Epcot joke? What'd you say? You're going to Epcot. Oh, okay. Fucking okay, man. hold on. Use R1 to terrain scanner. The terrain scanner surveys the area of American danger such as... Oh, so blah, blah, blah. Indicating an increasing area of risk. The terrain scanner can help find safer routes. Okay. Why are those more risky than these? That's, what I, that's interesting. Because there's like a little rock there that you can... I guess it is because little rocks. It's low risk. Deep. Blue is low risk. If you can't walk across some water, buddy, then I feel bad for your son. You got 99 problems, and walking across some water is definitely one of them. I feel like this is just Landscape Simulator 2020. Oh, getting dangerous. Man, Mike's getting speedy. <laughs> that baby's got some... No, man, use your... Are you talking about the baby itself? Or are you talking about the, the device and just referring to it as that baby? Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. Cargo verified. Thank you. City. No one seemed to know what it meant for the organization, or the UCA, or us. The oxytocin will take the edge off, and that'll be a big help. Won't be long before we're back on track. We may have a look. <laughs> this is great. Thank you again. He's gonna give you a like. Yeah, everything looks to be in good order, and soon our way station will be too. I hope. See, like it says, car condition less than fifty percent damage, ten percent. What does that mean? Ten percent was damaged. Or does it mean the cargo condition is ten percent? I don't know. No, because then it would be under fifty percent, right? You're with the second team, right? Where are the others? Dead, caught in the void out. No way. That one blast got them all. And what? They just sent you out on your own? I mean, if it was just a delivery, that'd be one thing. Porters come through from time to time, but... The second team was meant to bring the cube, but they were gonna connect us up. 
Three years we've been waiting for help. Three years. And they send us one guy who's... Shit, shit, shit. Bro, I got purple glasses. Tell me you brought more than the Oxy, at least. I've got the Cupid. You... Really? So it's true. They finally got it working. Well, then you just might be the answer to my prayers. So, what are you waiting for? But you, you put us on the goddamn grid? So basically this game is going literally all the way across America. <laughs> that's what I, yeah, that's what I, that's the impression I'm under currently. That's the impression that I get. Epic equipment, make delivery, delivery loss, share locker, don't need one equipment, withdrawal cargo, okay. All this for cotton swabs? No, Cupid's man, Not Valentine's Q -tip, Day. Cupid. God. Connection to capital, not city, confirmed. It's really happening. <laughs> Just like Amelie promised. We can finally do what we came here to do. Hey, you're headed west, right? Gonna be a lot of people happy to see you. I guess you'll keep on until you hit the coast, huh? Which means you'll get to see Amelie. Oh, for first. love. Makes sense. <laughs> oh, that's something. That is really something. I... Me, I've never met her. Only seen her hollow messages back when I was with the first expedition. Well, anyway, you best be careful on the road. There's some bad people out there. More than good, some say. <laughs> but I don't need to tell you that. Thank you, Sam. By bringing that way station into the Cairo network, you've put it in direct contact with those of us back here in Capital Knot City. Right. I think it's your turn now. Are you What's sure? Next? It's only been 50 minutes. 53 minutes. The way station are a couple of All you did was run a little bit. One mission, place. and then it's your mission. Is your next destination, Fort Knot City. It's on the shore of a crater lake that formed after the first void out. Your objective is to link up Fort and Capital Knot. But to do that, you'll need to utilize our facilities as additional waypoints. They'll be essential for establishing a stable connection. Given what? the distance we need to cover, so We're you can't just go straight to here. You have to go here first, then there, and then there. station. As to which you should head for first. Seems like a lot of work. Start with the distro center. We've got some cargo that needs delivering anyway. Check the nearby delivery terminal to pick it up. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery nope. terminal for further information. Is that it? That's the yeah, delivery terminal. So. Yeah. Works paying off, Sam. Thanks to the increase in network capacity, HQ is now in a position to provide you with additional materials and support. Okay. Should prove useful. Oh, it looks like you might be homeless too. <laughs> Use carpeting to fabric with weapons and other items. I can make ladders, climbing anchors, or PCCs. Sam, you can use that PCC to build a post box. Uh, but be aware of doing so will use up some chiral bandwidth available to you. Structures can be shared with other players once. Other players? Yeah, it's like those things that we found. They were dropped by other people. What? Yeah. I don't really care about that, though. Because I'm a jerk. Circle's back. I, I know it, it wasn't working, though. You had to, like, go through the things. Okay, so... I'd make one more ladder, man. Or, I mean, one more rope. I can't. Why not? Because I don't have any... Oh. Things. Right? Can I? It says required zero, 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 but that doesn't make any sense, right? A ladder. How many do you require? I already have two, right? How many more do I need? Yeah, I wouldn't make any ladders. I don't think you need more. You want ladders. these? Yeah, I'd say one more of those. 
Oh, okay. It changes as you, as you, okay, so I need like, yeah, I'll make two. That's fine. Where do, you, where do you keep them? Carry on the back? Yeah, just a little. So on my back, I have two ladders, two climbing anchors. On my tool rack, I got a climbing anchor. On my boot clip, I got to bridge my boots. And I got my boots on my boots on my boots. <laughs> boots on, boots on, boots. Cancel. Uh, confirm? Sure. Sam's dog tags have theoretical physics equations on them. I bought a replica of his dog tag. That's awesome, actually. Let's take some orders on. I'm going to construct a post box. Man, who's got the time, dude? I wouldn't do that. I'd do the other one. I'm doing this one. Yeah. Uh, okay, so six items to deliver. Okay. Let's accept them orders, my dude. Head circle. Hold X. Oh, accept orders. Yeah, gotcha. It's hard to see some things. Like, there's so much going on on the screen that it's kind of like hard to make out things. Like, where's the button? I don't know. I'm, look, I'm just done. Like, how do I get out of here? Hold X. Hold X? I just yeah. did. Okay, do it again. Okay. Then it goes to fabricate equipment. Now go to confirm, yeah. Oh, now it goes to delivery prep. Like Now go, you know, hit X. Why, why do I have to do all this? Because you've just accepted more cargo. What are you talking about? Hit X. Hold X. Oh, God. Centric, I'm glad you think so. Oh, Jesus. You can have, you can have it auto-arranged. I wonder if that's better, just a triangle. Where do you see that? Oh, auto range. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. <laughs> she looked like a straight up gunman. <laughs> <laughs> Someone mentioned it earlier, but now you really do look like a gundam. <laughs> Alright, so now what? Now Confirm X. again. Alright, let's keep confirming. Head out? Yeah, let's get the F out of here. Oh Jesus. How do you even walk? <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, he looks so ridiculous. Man, I feel like solid Why snake. Why are you carrying extra boots? What's that for? You know, double boots. Double boots. Is that the way you need to go? Oh, is it gonna rain? I thought it was, right? Wasn't there? Where are you going, man? I don't want to place your out. Where's the map? Options. Right here, right? Yeah. And routey placement is... You gotta place marker you. square. No, it's over right there. Oh, you can do it backwards. That's nice. All right. All right, you're good. Weapons restrictions lifted. Well, that's good. Apparently, you can have weapons in this game. Good lord, look at them. I wonder how how well you can jump in this gear. Just hit X real quick. Oh, it's pretty decent. God, he's like, dude, no Maurice like has to be like, hero. yeah, he has to be like, like super, superhero strong, man. Am I running out of juice? I feel like I didn't do that to the ground. Is something? What's that? What's going on? Heads up, Sam. Your cargo's been pinged. Move. Now, before someone has eyes on you. Get to your destination ASAP if you don't want to get caught. Well, I don't want to get caught, but I also don't want to get attacked either, so... Yeah, there's guys to your left. There's guys to my left? Yep, just keep going. Don't. Is that the other... 
Oh shit, cargo pirates. I'm trying to find clear paths so I don't have to like stumble or break my neck. I don't want to break my neck. I just want to be a postman in the future. <laughs> Your postman? No one can stop the postman. Do, 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 Neither do, do, rain do, 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 nor sl I, I'm not doing this. I'm out of. I'm out. Oh, they, did they give up? They're like, ah, forget it. He was too quick. Oh, the rain, because they're smart. Equipment not carried in a container deteriorates when time fall touches it. Equipment tools and equipment hung from attachments will be severely affected by time fall. I'll just ignore the baby for now. You gotta get out of the rain. That was a bit of an ambitious fall. Oh, you can do it, but I can't. This is real ambitious. Okay, you might be right. Yeah, I think you gotta go around. Okay, left and... I was trying to calm the baby, but I wasn't playing when it... when it had to be done, so I forgot what the command was. It's also weird that, like, I have to, like, choose which things to put in containers and not, like, it's really, like, micromanaging. Like, there's a lot of micromanaging, it feels like. Like, pick where these equipments go and, like, all these cargoes goes and, like, pick... You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, I got you. I think you can run, right? I thought I am running. God damn it, man. This is just running simulator. What's happening? Rain getting worse? Uh, double click R1. R1? Oh, Jesus. R1 to hold your breath, by the way. Should I run? Yeah, you can run. When that spins faster, it's bad. 
You can still walk. Hold your breath. Yeah, I don't think so, man. Damn it. Well, how do you avoid them? You just keep walking and hold your breath. I don't think that's how it works, man. Every time I keep walking, that's how they see me. Okay, cool. Well. You know, I've never encountered giant whales. Gotta sneak and hold your breath. Breaking apart. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you. I, this was really part of what happened last time. Uh, is there like a way you're supposed to go? What is that? I have no idea what's even happening right now. I guess we're just running from Cthulhu. Care. Got got bigger problems. I don't think it's even possible to get up there, right? Just keep climbing, I guess. Anakin, I have the high ground. That was close. Was it close? I have no idea what I just was involved in. All my fucking cargo is probably to, to shit right now. Oh, I, don't, I think you're going backwards now, technically. I'm Sam! I'm Sam. Hmm.
Uh, okay, so if I just take, if I just turn left a little bit. Yeah, this is fine. This is the right way. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh god, please don't die. Slow down! I can't. It's so hard to control sometimes. Alright, we did it. I was gonna pick whatever that is up. I don't think I can get these yet. Oh, you're right. She just starts going too fast, and I'm like, oh my god, slow down, bro. Oh, look at all these fish that died. <laughs> Jesus. You get the easy shit. You're like, I gotta deliver some drugs to this place. And I'm like, well, it'll be like falling over. Yep, here we go. Stamina juice. You tell me what to do. How do you do it? I Left. Right. We didn't. Baby. Auto toxemia. When the strain on your BB exceeds sustainable levels, it triggers the production of harmful compounds, and the body, in essence, begins to attack itself. It's called auto toxemia. If your BB's not performing to spec, drop by your private room and see if the incubator helps. Like that. Like, what are you doing, dude? Oh, look, all of the cargo's damaged. Oh, yeah, you're in the. Oh, look, a vehicle. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All weapons will remain locked until departure. Cargo verified. Decontaminating suit. Advised. Yeah, you think? <laughs> Make delivery. Sorry, I fucked up your cargo. Wake station folks told me all about you. Sam Bridges, with the second expedition, right? The guy expanding the chiral network on his lost home. What he's not out making deliveries. So what'd you bring us? Let's see it. Thanks. Can't imagine how you managed to haul this stuff through BTville. Wait, Sam? As in Sam Porter, that legendary delivery guy? <laughs> well, I'll be. Alright, see you later.
Uh. Well, you only damage him 50%. I guess. It could be worse. So. Wonder what my score is. You can skip this. So it goes faster. Hey! Still got an A. They saw what I went through. In real life, though, making from here to here to here it would, would not take, take four minutes. It would take so much longer. Sam, as always, thanks for bringing more folks into the UCA. Oh, we got mail data, and now we can recycle at delivery terminals. Look at all these things now. It's too much. It's over. It's a little. I'm over just moment. like, don't care. I'm not doing any of these extra things. I'm just. Network. I just want to see the story. And with those materials you brought for our chiral printer, we can produce supplies for you here as needed. Think of it as our way of returning the favor. Now head west and keep on doing what you do. Good. The distro center is on the network. Sam, do me a favor. Take your BP to a private room and connect it to the incubator. Good work. Yeah, I'm surprised you made it through that kerfuffle, buddy. I'm a kerfuffle master. <laughs> Clearly. Dead man, you there? Little help. Okay, Sam. Remove the pod and connect it to that incubator. It's in. Good. Uh, Head temporary west. excessive stress. Easily addressed if we return it to its mother's womb. What? Mother. Uh, located in the capital, not city, ICU. Brain dead, of course. Ah, uh, you mean still mother? Correct. A still mother's womb facilitates a connection between the world of the dead and the BB. Why? And you, in turn, connect yourself to a BB. Oh, why does it do that? To sense BTs. How does it do that? These pods were designed to simulate the conditions inside a still mother's womb. Why? BBs need to believe <laughs> they're in one at all times to function properly. However, we can only maintain this deception for so long, which is why we must periodically update the environmental data by synchronizing it with a still mother via the chiral network. There. The update is in progress. Right now the pod is synchronizing with the steel mother in Capital Knot City and reconfiguring its settings based on the latest data. Returning your BB to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress levels. That being where it technically belongs, of course. Kid looks happy. I'll try adjusting the oxytocin dosage. 
Autotoxemia should set in much slower from now on. <sighs> it only set in this quickly as a way to explain it in the story. Uh, you should remember that BBs are just equipment. Try not to get attached. Each one has been physically removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable and prone to failure. No BB on record has remained in service for over a year. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. And then, you're saying there's no way to keep my BB alive? Uh, you must understand, there is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. As we yeah, expand the neither. Kyle network and recover more past data, Same, buddy. perhaps we'll find our answers. Uh, oh, right. You asked me to look into why the BTs might be reacting to your blood. I spoke with Hartman. We should have your results soon. Anyway, get some rest. You and your BB are both exhausted. <sighs> Good night, Sam. I don't understand. <laughs> Why did he? Why? I don't know. I don't get it. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down. I didn't even sleep with a pillow, man. What? I didn't even sleep with a pillow. Lady. Sam? Can you see me? How are things over there? Still not under guard, still not chained up, still can't leave. But if you can keep making connections, if you can get to me, we can go back east, back home. Too much insanity in the cutscenes. <laughs> Russell runs to Metal Gear Solid 4, wow. I'm just I 4 was actually that. pretty tame as far as weird this stuff goes. It's really 2 where that all really happened. It's bad. There are fewer and fewer people in the cities these days. No one's having children anymore. But humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together, to help one another. And if we as a people can't do that, if we can't reconnect, then, well, it's like Bridget said, <laughs> extinction. Come on. Rebuilding America isn't going to get rid of the BTs. As long as they're still around, there's no escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. I'll be waiting, Sam. So the thing about Metal Gear Solid 4 is that I feel like the concepts, at least, are relatable you can understand the it's concepts. about war it's about and machines and like military guys Waiting you know for you come and find me like there's some weird stuff in it but but like it's presented through normal stuff right whereas like this all the concepts are completely alien to me so the nothing straightforward is your guy delivering packages that's about that's it. The, yeah that's where the this that's where it ends since you're awake might behoove you to freshen up. To that end, why not take a shower? Wow. It's good for the body and so, and also my research as it happens. UPS is serious Sam, business. This is Hartman. Dead man relate your request to me, as I oversee BT research. 
I'll be taking a sample of your shower water in order to study the effects your bodily fluids might have on a BT. You just sound like a weirdo. You study other people with dooms? Everyone in Bridges, myself and Mama. Results thus far are inconclusive. But you possess other singular qualities, being a repatriate as well. I must confess to a measure of optimism. Processing fluids, waste products, dry relic, dispensing. Just giving a shower water away for free? Take the sample with you. Should the opportunity arise, he can try give away his on the BT. Gamer I'm Boy. To see how they what is it called? Gamer Girl Bathwater? Gamer Boy Gathwater? Gathwater? <laughs> it may even prove beneficial to you. So you want me to take there my shower water? research paper detailing the effects of bodily fluids from individuals like us on BTs. And toss it on a BT. It is only by recovering these materials that we can unearth the knowledge of the past. Not just the death stranding, but also the mystery of your body's unique properties and even our doom's affliction. I don't know what dooms is. I don't know what BTs yeah, are. They haven't explained well, anything about dooms yet. They just say you have it. I don't know Sam, what it is. I have no like you're repatriate. We understand America. what that means. It means you can come back I dead and find right. a strand. The but dooms, they haven't explained anything about oh, it. It's almost time. After you make your connections and nothing happens, then what? I said then what? I just remember an hour of cutscenes and five minutes of an interesting gameplay. It's Sam, sorry to bother you while you're taking a break, but I figured you'd want to hear this. No soap. That's why people are dying there. <laughs> we received a number of messages addressed to you, and I've not taken a look myself, but I gather they're mostly from your clients. You should see if they contain any useful information. Mail can be accessed via your cufflinks, as well as the terminal in your private room. There's something else I'd like to share with you. With the Cairo network, we now have the power to reclaim our past. Data once thought lost forever from every corner of America can be pieced back together from fragmented records. Our archives are still a work in progress, of course. But as we expand the network and integrate more way stations and cities, we'll be able to cover more and more information, such as the previous expedition's logs and reports. Everything they sent back was lost when Central Knot City was destroyed. Now, we've managed to restore some already, in fact. You can access them from a private room terminal or your cufflinks by selecting Archives. Might make for interesting reading. Nope, not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't do, I don't do that in any games, dude. Like, you can view the holotape. Oh, wait, I got the quest mark. I don't have to actually listen to it? Okay, I'm not listening to it. Would I have to if you if you if you if it talks to me I'll do it. But if I have to like sit here and scroll up and read something on a game while I'm streaming, like, like nope, sorry, I'm out, dude. Let's check on this BB. BT BBs and now BMs. Wow. Do a BM. Baby looks happy. All right. I guess you can just leave now. In theory. How, in, how long we got this, man? In theory, this is an hour and a half. Really? Yeah, yeah. and we've done like so little. <laughs> well, we've done two missions. This is just Story Simulator 2019. Yeah, but what's the mission? You just run. You walk straight and like you put a ladder up. Like that's yeah. The gameplay wasn't really rewarding, I'll be honest. This isn't what we agreed on. Well, they said something about weapons, so in theory there's weapons later. So maybe there's more gameplay later on. This woman in the mask has done nothing but lie to me. Take a little boop and then throw it at the ghost or squid dolphin. Yeah, that's a that's a strategy right there. All right, let's. Sam, how does Snickers? How's it doing at the moment? Uh, before I answer that, something wrong? 
When I hook up my BB, I see things. What kind of things? Like a face, someone I don't know, calling to me. There's this room, too, with other people talking, but I can't make out the words. Hmm, lead through effect. Didn't I warn you about this? You're mistaking the BB's memories for your own. They're false flashbacks, nothing more. Let me explain. A BB is harvested from its steel mother at around 28 weeks and placed in a pod. To be clear, this is before it's even born. The procedure halts its development. But even at 28 weeks, that seems cruel. its sensory systems have matured enough to process external stimuli. It is more than capable of encoding this information into memories, which can bleed into yours via your connection. So who's the man I saw? Someone from the medical team, maybe? Or a BB technician? Does it matter? The BB has been in circulation for a while now. It's been handled by a lot of people. How should I know which one made an impression? Because you're the expert. No one's an expert, Sam. BBs were developed decades ago in secret. They're your quintessential black boxes. We may use them, but we don't truly understand them. Believe me, I've been trying to learn more, but almost all of the old records are gone. If I find anything out, I'll tell you, alright? Dead man's honor. Yeah, Mark, your English is awesome, by the way, man. Like, Sam, check the delivery terminal and review the list of orders. There's like minor things here that like is or are and stuff like that, but like it's so easy to just, just you know, fix it as I go. It's not even a like it's nothing is a um, and it's none of it's an understanding issue. You know, it's always like just a minor grammatical thing that doesn't even matter. Like your English is probably better than Mike, to be honest with you. Well, you're <laughs> I won't argue that. Unfortunately, our printer is offline. I know, I know, after all the trouble you went through to bring us those materials. This one's on us. We ordered a part a while back, but it never arrived. The printer needs it to communicate with the chiral network. The mules must have snatched it, caught that porter en route or something. If I'm right, they'll have taken it to their drop site, which is smack dab in the middle of their territory. Don't suppose you'd be up for stealing us our property back? Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. That seems dangerous. Uh, this, it's weird. Is it weird that I want like a gun or a weapon or something? Well, they said they said you can now use weapons in this area once, like on the screen. So I figure, in theory, you can get weapons. You want me to go all the way in this fucking mountain and get this stupid thing, and then bring it back? Can I just be like, no, I don't want to do that. What's the other one? It's backwards. Let's not do that one. Do I want to do this one now? What? You want to do it? Yeah, sure. All yours. Mama's added a watchtower schematic to your PCC. If you don't have it on you, consider fabricating one. You never know when you'll need to recon an area. I've heard so, Mark, I've heard so many stories about people who just learn English from, like, American movies or, like, um, shows and stuff like that's so crazy to me because I feel like I feel like no matter how many like if I was trying to learn French or something no matter how many French movies I watched I feel like I wouldn't like pick up the language but maybe that's not true also MTG is also a great way to do it because you know all the words on the cards already so if you see like uh, like a grave titan in a different language you know exactly what the text is so it's basically like a direct translation for you, you know? I think the more you do for other players, the better the game gets. That's interesting. Wait, what? Wait, what? The Death Stranding story. 
Oh, I think there's something. What is that? Is that a cheerleader? Decontaminating suit. All Where are you going? Welcome, Sam. Why Porter is this? Oh, never mind. Okay, so... He needs me to go here. But there's not like a mission marker. Why is that? Oh, I know why. No, just kidding. I don't fucking know. Have a pleasant journey. Keep on keeping on. Hello. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. I just feel like there's not enough. My, my other issue is that like when I watch things in other languages, they talk so fast. Like, I assume I also speak quickly in English. I just don't notice it because I'm fluent in English, you know, but like in other languages, like whenever I hear French being spoken or, you know, Portuguese being spoken or Spanish, whatever, they always talk so fast. And that was one of my big problems when I took foreign languages that I was like, I don't know where one word stops and another one starts. That was always an issue I had. It just sounds like one long blur of a word. Sideways, be ready to fight. <sighs> I stopped and I realized that a simple word like science is called nature wise and chef. Oh my god, dude. I think saying that is probably a lot easier than like having to write that every single time. That's ridiculous. Oh, come on. Equipping strands. Equip strand. A strand can be used to quickly and silently rent. Okay. You should you should really Remember be more Sam, vigilant about this stuff on the screen. Before you approach the mule drop site, we recommend you use a watchtower to confirm the location of the post box containing our cargo. The mule drop sites are rarely deserted, so remaining undetected is key. Keep a low profile and move slowly to minimize noise. Hmm. So you could never see other players in the game, right? How do they leave stuff for you, though? That's what I don't understand. Like, where are they? I'm what right if you... here. Didn't what? want to do that. <laughs> that was real loud. Michael, you gotta be quiet. I'm right here! That's so weird to me. It's weird that they integrate, like, this random multiplayer element into this game. Do you feel like the movement is really restrictive? Yeah, but what? I think that's part of the challenge. I'm gonna stick with it, I just don't know if I'm enjoying it as much as I wish I was. I'll be honest, I'm not enjoying it that much either. I like the story, but like the gameplay, just like, it's awkward and confusing. I agree, I think there's, there's too so much. much to there's too much, yeah, I agree. The problem is, like, there's a lot of story, but, like, you might as well have just made it a movie. Right. Story is good, gameplay is mediocre at best. 
That seems to be the consensus, which is interesting because the game got really, really good reviews. Maybe it gets better later, I don't know. I just want to be there for the, like, the, the, where they're, like, brainstorming the game and they're like, no, you're a carrier and you can put all, you can put a thing here and you can put a thing on this arm and you can have, like, six on your back and you just walk around. What? Are you crazy? Well, like, like, who's this? <laughs> who's this army of ten? Sam, you can use share lockers to exchange. What you want to know about that? Why did you skip that? Because I don't want to share nothing. But I still want to know what it's there for. This is where it told me to go, and there's nothing in here. So this is no where. What about is activate terminal? Is that what you did? Yeah, I did. It told me to go to this and get it. Wait, what is What's this? Great view. Hold on. What is that? That's just a sign someone placed there? Great view? What does that mean? Well, I... It's really annoying, because, like, you asked me to do this mission, but you don't actually tell me where to go. Like, uh... Yeah, activate terminal. Just... Yeah, there's nothing to... They can't make a delivery. There's nothing to pick up. Okay, stop. You're getting frustrated. <laughs> I'm gonna press it nine times! Yeah, I wish we just find where this... I should just run, run through these rocks or something and hope to get there. Okay, it's gotta be down there. That must be it. Yeah, jump down. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, I've heard a lot of people say that it's not until, like, they- I've heard it's not until, like, ten hours in that it starts to get, like, really- it starts to make sense and stuff. Wow. Okay. Rock your baby. <laughs> now I get it all the way up. Mark, I don't know if it's similar, but when I took both Italian and French, the two things that I had a big difficulty with were gender, uh, male and female words. And like, eel and, in, in, uh, I can't even think of like other options right now, actually. Are you sneaking into this camp or do you have permission? Pretty sure this is a sneak. Just carrying in my baby. Look at your friggin' backpack, dude. What is- like, I have no idea what all this stuff is. Resins, metals, metals. <laughs> You're just memeing now, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, I think I'm good. Auto range? You don't want that last metal? Yeah, auto arrange that shit, see what happens. I already did. Oh, 
Oh, you got 192 with 120 you can carry. This dude's gonna literal murder you, just so you know. Uh, how do I unselect? What does LMS stand for? Small, medium, large? Probably. Well, you can't get rid of that printer interface. That's like what you need. Which one's that? The one that says chiral printer interface. The one that's literally named. Offload. Can we save it here? Because I feel like we're about to call it. It said changes will be undone, and you were like, okay. Oh. Well, I think I'm screwed. Because I didn't want to do that. <laughs> How do you defend yourself, though? I'm just going to try to get back to the... Uh, that's fine. Drop stuff, is that a thing I can do? Let's try this again. That's unfortunate. Oh, it's unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate. I meant to offload that. Oh, oh that's unfortunate. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> can I reload? <laughs> All cargo's been stolen. <laughs> for example, the is used independent. Timefall looks like it's attached to time for anything. Yeah, okay, we knew that. The is used independently of the gender. Here we have to change this for each gender. We often see the difficulty we'll have to use those. Even Glenn Greenwald, which lives here for over a decade, he still has this problem. Yeah, I mean, like, that's the thing. I like because I, I feel like there's no pattern to it. I can't look at the word and be like, "Damn addicts chasing a cargo high." It's a shame we got to deal with their bullshit at all. Look at all your stuff. Back in the day, AI did everything. Deliveries were handled by unmanned vehicles and drones, and all we had to do was sit back and let this, them right? work. It was revolutionary. Damn near what? singularity. No Where's your printer, bro? To I gotta go back and get it. it Wait, it's not like there. We took the human element no, out of I think the it's back here. Industry. It's not there with all the cargo so that you had. Just some consideration. We put it back Who in. knows, man? What does all this mean? Jobs, no one really needed, and gave them the folks you don't want those climbing out. anchors? You don't want any of your stuff? There like snowball. Yeah. Now we got cults of cargo chasing crazies who get off on hijacking shipments. Jackals always on the lookout for the next order. Make sure you're not him. What that ladder, man? Get that fucking ladder. Oh, you're just picking up everything. Okay, you're just literally stacking up just like you were last time, man. Can you save here? And we can just figure this out tomorrow? Yeah, I, I don't know if I'm saved or what's going on. Okay, stop falling over. It's just stop. Just stop moving. It's literally telling you on the screen what to do. I, drop I think you're I th no where's your sleep button I don't remember how to do that man I'll be honest <laughs> what about this is this it no yeah put your glasses on there you go take them off good good job okay I don't remember how I did that <laughs> Don't click on any of these things. Oh, I'm gonna check on my baby. I'm just trying to figure it out. <laughs> it says check on baby if you hit down, and that's what you did. So, I'm gonna try to figure it out by checking on my baby. There we go. Well, enjoy it. At least while it lasts. 
I don't know if you can I don't know if you can say with all this shit on your back. How do I drop stuff? Buddy, I have no idea. What are you asking me? What is PCC? Yeah, I think I think those you need though. I think you need those. This game seems extremely complicated. Hmm. Yeah, I agree with you. Learning curve seems high, man. Get rid of all these fucking metals, man. Man, you thought you thought inventory management like Fallout was rough, man. This is this is next level. What if in Fallout, every time you pick something up, it would show up on your person like, Oh, I picked up some some dino puffs, and now they're like on your bag and stuff. You can see them. Michael's not in the mood right now. He's so done with this game. Hideo yeah, Kojima let him down. Yeah, I just don't know what's... I don't need these many. Why is there, why are they all, why are they so big? Why are these climbing anchors so big? You're gonna get out of here and it's gonna like. Did I, did I not do it? Yes, it says changes will be undone. Are you sure? And then you hit yes every time. That shouldn't be how it works. It's really stupid. I don't know, I don't like it. <laughs> all I gotta do is read my dude. I don't like reading. I went over this in the game already. It told me to read a thing and I denied. I said, no, I'll never read it. My name is Michael. I don't read in games. <laughs> oh my God. Every time it's like, change will be undone. Would you like to do this? And I'm just watching it and I'm like, oh God, he's gonna fucking, uh, <laughs> he's gonna have to do it again. You guys are doing great. Man, that's good to hear. Cause like, it's hard to tell. It's real hard to tell. Confirm. Oh, Thank you did God. it! Look okay, at all now, that shit. Can I sleep now? Okay, how did I rest? I don't remember how I did it. There we go. Not a moment too soon. Save. It said save complete. Okay. Then fuck off. <laughs> all right. Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching part two of oh. Death Stranding. I hope you guys are enjoying it at least a little bit because we don't know what's going on. And we're hoping, we'll give it a few, we'll give it some more time and we'll see if we can figure it out and like try to play the game. I feel like we did like 10 minutes of playing in like an hour and a half. Well, to be fair, my meme got us killed. I shouldn't have done it. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to put it all on my back. see what happened. And then the guys are like, all right, I guess I'll just fucking kill you. It's worse than fall. Like, you get over encumbered and you move slow. But in this, you're just like, no, you literally fall over and you get knocked out. And then you're... And the, yeah, out. it's worse because you have a weapon in Fallout and you don't have a weapon in this. You're just like, I guess keep and hitting me. If I was over encumbered, I could still shoot at people, you know? Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on twitch.tv slash franklapore, patreon.com slash franklapore. Cool stuff, think, every Wednesday at manatraders.com. There's a link and a promo code for 20% off your first three months of any subscription down below. So check those out. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.